Former Olympic gold medalist Andy Cruz wins a wide unanimous decision against Juan Carlos Burgos. His first bout, 10 rounders, which is, you know, unheard of. Only dudes that do stuff like that. It's like Vasil Lomachenko. But um, he watched it. Complete boxing lesson. Did whatever he wanted to do. Burgos really posed no threat. This was a great first fight. It was a guy that's never been stopped. I mean, he's been in there with Devin Haney, Keyshawn Davis, Xavier Martinez. Never been stopped. So... Uh, it was it was good to see where Andy was at because Keyshawn had his seven fight against him and this is Andy's first fight. This is like straight from the amateurs to the pros and only had a couple of months with training Bozianis, but like you can see he's slowly adapting to the Bozianis style of boxing, which is a lot of sitting in the pocket, catching and shooting. It's just it's just overall like complete style of boxing. Outside, inside, like they can just beat you a multitude of ways. And he definitely preaches that. So, Andy, Andy definitely showed some pluses, showed some room for growth. But like I said, he's only been in America for a couple of months, only been with Bozy for a couple of months. So, you were going to see a steady improvement over time. But yeah, great matchmaking by Eddie Hearn, putting him in there with a guy that's going to be durable, that he can get the rounds and get that experience. So, I'm definitely happy from what I saw. And, you know, I got a chance to see him a lot during camp. And you can just see him just getting better over time and him adapting to the pro style. And I feel like that's the, the biggest thing. Going from three rounds at Cuban boxing where you just, you know, tearing somebody's ass up for three rounds. And then, you know, in the 10 where, you know, you might start off a little bit slower and things are a little bit more calculated. But yeah, uh, great job, Andy Cruz. Great job, Bozy Ennis. Uh, Lawrence Smalls, you know, er everybody in the camp. Yeah, great performance. Uh, I look forward to seeing more, man. YSM Sports Media, we out.